Shamrock Series, Purdue, a 2-0 start. It's a big week for Notre Dame football. Brian Kelly gave his weekly media briefing this afternoon to, you know, set the stage for the rest of the week. WSBT Sports Director Pete Byrne joins us from the live desk right now. And Pete, you know, coaches, they, they never look past any opponent. Of course not, Rick. And despite what would appear to be a fairly lopsided matchup on paper, the Notre Dame Purdue Series has actually been incredibly competitive lately. And that's what has Brian Kelly's attention heading into the weekend. Last year, the Irish needed a second-half charge to rally past the Boilers in West Lafayette. Two years ago at home, a young Everett Golson was pulled in favor of Tommy Reese in the fourth quarter, who led a game-winning drive in the final minutes. Both those games, like this year's, featured a Purdue team that on paper appeared to be overmatched, only to push the Irish to the limit. So Brian Kelly says he will get his team ready for a tougher game than many people think they'll actually have. The games we've had against Purdue over the last couple of years have been... Uh, Real tough ones. Uh, last year, 31-24, uh, and uh, certainly two years ago here at Notre Dame, needing a great comeback. And you know, we know about uh, the resolve that they'll play with. Uh, it's an opportunity for them to play at Lucas Oil Field on national television. Uh, there'll be a lot of enthusiasm and emotion on their side. Uh, so uh, we know what's going to happen Saturday night uh, from Purdue's end. Now it's about what we do and how we respond uh, to that. So I think it's pretty clear that uh, our players understand what they're going to get from Purdue, and that is uh, their very, very best. The game is a 740 kickoff Saturday night at Lucas Oil Stadium in Indianapolis. It's the annual Shamrock Series game, so the Irish will be wearing special uniforms, and I'll have much more with Coach Brian Kelly about what makes this series game so special. That's coming up at 6. Reporting at the live desk, Pete Byrne, WSBT, Channel 22 Sports.